Yeah, and in terms of the, the launch itself, uh, you know, I mentioned at the beginning it was an exciting ride, and that really doesn't do it justice, to be honest. Um, Bob and Doug described it pretty well. Um, but to just when uh, you're sitting there on the rocket as it's going through the fueling process, you know, there's noises and vibrations, and it, uh, in many sense, it just, it, you can tell it wants to get off the ground. And particularly in those last uh, two, three minutes as uh, the final fueling's happening and, uh, and the strong batch retracting and things of that nature, it's, it's definitely ready to go. And it, it just, it leaped off the, the pad. It was amazing. And, and right after we, uh, about 40 seconds into the flight, you throttle back a little bit and you definitely notice that. But then when it was time to get going again, it, it really picked up and yeah, and it was, it was really moving. Uh, staging is always pretty exciting. I think on any rocket and this one is no different. Uh, there was uh, when the, when the first stage uh, shuts off and, and separates and then that second stage kicks in, you, you definitely know that as well. And then this just slow, steady build up in G's all the way up into orbit. Um, but uh, I tell you, we were we were all very excited. Uh, we were when we passed the 100 kilometer point. We all said, uh, "Welcome to space, to Ike." The biggest stories, the moment they happen from around the globe. Subscribe to Bloomberg Quick Take now for insight in an instant.